Hi all to the viewers of Tech Geek SG. Today I'm going to take a look at the advanced mode of the ASUS P8H67-V motherboard. So currently over here you can see this is the FE BIOS utility under the advanced mode. Normally when you open uh, the when you when the first time you switch on your computer and you go into the BIOS, you'll come in to a place where you see the easy mode so in order to switch over to the advanced mode all you need to go do is to come here click the exit at slash advanced mode click then you come to here click on advanced mode then you'll come to advanced mode understand yeah that's as simple as that firstly on the main menu we have the bios information the bios revision uh, like which, which version is it the date the build date the bios version as well as the CPU information, memory information, basically just things that you want to know about your computer, like your current clocks and things like that. Then it comes to AI tweaker. Then you have your target DRAM speed, which is uh because because currently let's say if I enable AI overclock tuner, uh the co uh, computer automatically overclock to your speed that you you hope to attain. And we have the memory frequency as well as EPU power saving mode, GPU boost, which is the button that is on the motherboard itself just now, DRAM timing control, CPU power management, CPU offsite mode sign, CPU voltage, and many different things that if you are not over overclocker, you won't really understand. Even as a as a novice uh, overclocker myself, I don't really understand everything over here. Yeah. Okay. Next, or oh, oh, make sure. And, and, and one thing that you, you can actually use your mouse to control the whole BIOS. So it's pretty cool. Uh, CPU configuration. That's like the basic uh, BIOS setup you get to see under the advanced, uh, advanced tab in the normal BIOS. CPU configurations like hyper threading, uh, C1 E state, C uh C all those all those C things. Yep. Turbo mode, Intel speed tab. Those settings you can set it over here just by either clicking for example like that then you can click maybe um, disable and, and enable pretty cool with the mouse or if not you can press the plus or minus sign on the keyboard system agent configuration and different things that you'll get to see on your BIOS and next we can come to monitor which shows all your temperatures and currently um, my fan is set to standard and it's super quiet right now yeah it's not even it's maximum speed as in and and the, yeah the 2600k runs really 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 cool it's like hovering between 33 and 34 degrees Celsius as you can and then next we have the boot which is your boot options and your boot um, priorities things like that then next to tools come to tools then we'll have ASUS Easy Flash utility which allows you to um, how would I say that um, use your USB thumb drive to flash your BIOS and ASUS OC profile allows you to save your OC profiles yep and actually the new BIOS revision will allow you to actually type in the profile name instead of using 1 to 10 so let's that's all about the BIOS, that's safe and safe changes. Thank you for watching, bye!